Welcome back to Land House. For Ashley's Valentine's Day present, I have gotten her something special here in this box. She's been asking for this for what? Two, three, four years? For a while. I've been complaining about it more so in the past like few months. Yeah, so I finally uh, caved in and got this for her. And we're gonna do a little unboxing. You ready? Yep. What if I dropped it and it like shattered? <laughs> It'd be very sad. <laughs> you need my knife again? I don't really want to use a knife now. It's got the charging cable in there too. Ooh. It's not rose gold, but that was an option. It's so thin. It is thin. It's quite thinner than this. Basically, it's a 13 inch MacBook Pro. Um, she's been wanting to use one of these. Uh, the last computer we bought her was really terrible. It was an HP. The laptop. Yeah, the laptop. The laptop. It's I HP really Pavilion 11, I think. And uh, it was just garbage. But so anyway, this should do a whole lot better for you. I just wanted something that I could carry around. It was more because when Seth's not here, I don't like Emma being in the office. Yeah, I like how the speakers actually are up top here. Mm -hmm. Good morning. It's about 14 degrees outside, and uh, nobody's in my local gym. So I thought I'd give you a quick uh, look around here. So all the, uh, the heavy stuffs out here. And then over there is uh, the machines and treadmills and stuff. But time to get a good workout in. I'm trying out a new hardware store in town, and they have some premium lumber here. Nice stuff. I have to come in here more often. Had a decent workout this morning. Uh, my New Year's resolution was to lose 15 pounds. Uh, and I have so far lost eight, which is really good. So I'm almost there. Uh, also went to that hardware store. It was uh, pretty amazing. I actually uh, am sad that over the past 19 years of living here, I've never been in because their lumber is way better than uh, the other hardware store or Lowe's. So uh, today I'm going to be making a coffee mug holder, which should be interesting. It's for our church and then I'm bringing in some groceries. Uh, they didn't have Ashley's coffee, so it might be a bad day. So far, I have cut the four pieces that will be the frame of the coffee mug holder. It's got 45s so that the corners will come together uh, nicely there. I think it's going to look decent so far. Uh, we'll see how that goes. But uh, So while that corner is gluing up, what I'm doing is making a floating shelf for um, the new baby's room. And so it's going to be 10 inches from the wall, so I've got some eight and a halfs there. And I'm about to cut uh, the plywood to make the actual outer box, but never made a floating shelf before. Should be interesting. Shop time is fun, but it turned about to be uh, about 38 degrees today, so I'm going to try and get a little bit of outdoor work done. Uh, back in the summer and spring, I was piling up a bunch of old logs at the end of my property here, and my neighbor up the hill has been gathering them for the past few months, and I uh, just noticed the pile is gone. So what I'm going to do, uh, I've got the chainsaw and uh, four-wheeler down here. Uh, I started clearing off this section right here in the fall 
and I want to uh, eventually have it cleaned up enough that I could have some grass and mow it. <laughs> More work, sure, but uh, so these trees that I cut down years ago for the power line, I'm going to just start uh, slowly cutting these up, throw them on the four-wheeler, and uh, take them down there to the pile. Uh, I mean, I could just skip the pile and just make a new pile like right here. Maybe I just do that. But there's this log here, that one over there, and then down there is a pine tree I cut. So anyway, let's see what we can get into. Okay, I'm glad I was able to get some of the logging work done. It's kind of bugged me that it's been so cold and I haven't been able to get out there to uh, do that kind of work. I've got a uh, very unique clamping job going on for Ashley's uh, floating shelf here. <laughs> Look at that, very interesting. So basically I'm gonna glue together all of the pieces here um, that I just cut on the table saw. Like there's a, uh, a side piece, like. That'll fit down in there, and then uh, we've got the bottom over here. And all of that will then slide on top of this piece, which will be uh, mounted on the wall. Uh, so hopefully it all works well. Never built one of these before. Not sure if I'm doing it right or not. And uh, definitely cheaper than having to go out and buy one. So there you go. Yeah, good morning. I know what you're thinking. Man, you look nice in that hat. No, uh, so I'm wearing these glasses. Uh, they're rather old and the prescription is wrong. Normally I have contacts. So we went to a friend's house a couple of days ago. Had supper, kids played. Uh, we, were, we were getting ready to leave and they're like, oh, by the way, our kids have had pink eye for about two days now. It's like, oh, thanks. Appreciate that. Uh, so Emma and I have a little case of that in the left eye. I'm not going to show you because I'll be demonetized. Um, I'm going to call them here in a bit and see if their kids were over it quick or if it was like three weeks because that will determine uh, bacterial versus viral infection. Well, uh, just here at the hardware store, um, bought some pipe for the uh, ram pump pressure tanks. And now I'm gonna head on to the house. Just made it home. It's too bad I'm feeling so terrible. Yeah, it's 53 degrees out today, which would be perfect for uh, doing some work. But I'm probably gonna go inside for a bit and just kind of relax and hang out with the family. Uh, yeah, man, the vlogs lately have been kind of terrible, haven't they? <laughs> I've been trying to uh, continue even though I've been sick and uh, all kinds of stuff, but I don't know. Maybe it's worth watching. So last night I was leaving for work and uh, I met a car halfway down our driveway. And uh, so I stopped and started backing up slowly and they got right up on. I already had a two inch back here. They got right up on me with their brights on. And I was like, come on people, give me a break here. And uh, so I finally backed up enough that I opened up space for the other driveway. And I was like, you know, maybe they'll just pull up in there and we'll get, we'll get going. No, they sat there and like watched me like move. <laughs> And so I tried to pull up into that spot, spun my tires, and anyway, it was about a five minute ordeal that should have been about a minute. But oh well, maybe I won't ever have to deal with them again. Yeah, whoever they were. Oh. 
Well, I know this video is ending kind of abruptly and uh, not a whole lot of content in this vlog, but uh, anyway, uh, if you would subscribe, I'd appreciate it. And if you're already subscribed, please don't leave. <laughs> I promise I'll get back to some real content soon. Coming up soon, I have a build of a coffee mug holder and some floating shelves, and then we'll get back to finishing the camera gantry. But anyway, I'm gonna lay here for a while, and uh, hopefully in a day or two, I'll be feeling back to normal. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.